guys. It is Heather Nicole with Ginger Tales. And um, I'm very well lit today. I'm not sure. I'm the bed behind me. Is that like, can you see the lump? Can you see the lump? There's a lump right there. There's a lump right there where I'm pointing. That's like a weenie dog. It's my parents' weenie dog. Um, my mom's, anyway. Um, so anyway, let's split some hairs. So, um, uh, while I, you know, fix some of this stuff, I'm using my, um, unique, best makeup ever, uh, mineral touch foundation. But I wanted to talk to you guys about, um, I got some messages, but they weren't like at the bottom where most people get messages. Yeah. You know. Oh, no. Because apparently I am retarded. Or not retarded. That's a, a horrible thing to say. I am um, common sense dysfunctional. That is what I am. I am common sense dysfunctional. Because, um, you know, instead of commenting to ask me questions, People just uh, went to my Facebook page and were like, hey, um, listen, you know, you uh, said you needed a haircut and we think your hair is great. Don't get a haircut. And I'm like, okay, one, thank you so much. That's great. And, you know, thanks for thinking my hair looks healthy and all that. And two, how in the heck did you find my Facebook page? Okay, let me tell you how. All right, well, before I change the name to Ginger Tales, okay, I had at the top of the page up there, you will see it says Heather Bruce. Okay, that's my last name, one. Then I changed it to Ginger Tales with Heather Nicole. So now, not only do you have my last name, you have my first and my middle. So you have my whole name. I guess you, I just, you know, should I draw maps to my house and you guys can all come visit? Ah, I don't know. But um, I have kids, so please don't do that. Um, you know, might scare the two-year-old. Who's that? Go away. Um, yeah, I'm wearing this horrible shirt. But there's a reason for it. It was a thrift store find. I'm a thrifter, but it has, where is she? It has Hello Kitty on it. How cute is that? That is super cute. I have Hello Kitty all over the shirt. It's like leopard. She's on here a bunch somewhere. There she is, found her again. Hello Kitty. Like, She's on here again. Hello Kitty right there. So it's like connect the Hello Kitty, you know. So it's like a horrible, like, I have no idea who made this shirt. I got it at a thrift store and it's like really horrible. It's like, um, I have no idea what anyone would, would make a zebra pink, a purple zebra Hello Kitty shirt, but they did. And I bought it because apparently... I thought I got to have a purple and pink Hello Kitty shirt. I don't know. Anyway, uh, Harper loves it. So, um, my daughter. And, um, but let's split hairs. All right. So, um, uh, oh, my other mistake yesterday, other than, you know, telling you guys totally who I am. <laughs> uh, not that you really care. Um, <laughs> <laughs> is I said my hairdresser had moved to Scotland. She did not. She moved to Ireland. So correction on that. Sorry, Brandy and fam. Um, and they're loving it there. So she's never coming back to fix my hair a bit, whatever. But you guys said, like, um, you know, your hair is really pretty. I took, put lots of curl in it today. I can do that sometimes. And it didn't look, you know, dead-ended or anything. Usually it's about 
down to here because I just brushed it out or whatever. Um, and today I just put a lot of coral in it. You know, you can do that kind of thing. But um, uh, what I do to my hair, and this is actually good advice. Um, before I get into the shower, when I'm um, putting my uh, cleanser on my face, you know, or whatever I'm going to, um, you know, to, for when I'm laying out my clothes, everything like that. I put my conditioner in my hair, like from here all the way back to the ends and just saturate it. And then while I'm getting dressed, I mean, while I'm getting everything laid out that I'm going to wear, while I'm, you know, handling everything, while I'm putting on my face mask or whatever I'm doing for the day, while I'm answering phone calls, whatever, then when it's time for me to take my shower, usually about, I leave it in about 10 minutes because I can't afford in a Brazilian blowout, okay? So, um, I will get into the shower and I will, you know, do everything I need to do. And the last thing I will do is wash my hair and get it all out and the back of my hair will feel like just amazingly soft okay now I take like a dime size just like a little bit of maybe like Pantene or whatever conditioner I'm into that moment I've even used lotion. We ran out of conditioner one time and I used lotion to just saturate my hair and get in the shower. Um, and uh, anyway, I picked like a dime size of um, Pantene, put that in my hair and um, get out of the shower. I don't rinse it out. Okay. And um, if my hair is still hard, I never comb my hair. Never. I always brush it. And um, if my hair is still like kind of hard to manage and brush, um, I will use my child's <laughs> grape uh, detangler. So I'm not ripping it when I'm brushing it. I never do that. Um, another thing I never use, like, um, you know, the, the rubber bands, the little twisty rubber bands, they break your hair really badly. So I always use these. I was told this is by the Magnific Magnificent Brandy. I just, yes, I used my lovely. Um, I never use uh, those. I always use the cloth ones because they don't they don't break your hair. That looks cute. It's kind of sassy. Okay. They break your hair and uh, they give you dead ends and you don't need that kind of problems. Uh, the front of my hair is really kind of thin because I had a lot of head surgeries and stuff, but um, the rest of it is like really long and pretty and I like it. Um, also, um, do not wash your hair every day. You want to wash your hair like every two days. The second day you, you have a little product built up in your hair and your hair will do like if you want to do an updo, do it that day. If you want to do like a really good um, ponytail or if you want to just do the magnificent curls or whatever, do it the second day because your hair will have the product in it and it will hold. Um, again, the magnificent branding. Um, also, um, uh, another thing that, um, I learned a long time ago, um, uh, I learned this on TV, actually. A celebrity, who I really admire, said that sometimes when she goes places, she doesn't have time to, on that third day, to or wash her hair, you know, the second day. She doesn't have time to wash her hair. She's got an appearance the third day. What does, should she do? Well, Sally Hansen and Walmart sells this stuff called Topics, T-O-P-I-X, and you can get it in your hair color. It even comes in red. Um, uh, a lot of older women use it for balding, and um, like if your roots are showing, like they've colored their hair and their roots are showing, they can put that on there instead of having to re-dye their hair. Um, 
what you do is you stand on towel, and I've even used like baby powder, but you got to be careful with that because then people think you have like gray roots or something. But you stand on a towel and you shake it into your hands like a big, you know, bunch, and you turn your head upside down and you just fluff it into your hair. And once you've got it nice and fluffed into your hair, um, what's that? Why do things keep popping up on me? Stop it. Um. Once you've got it, get it into the roots because the oil comes from your roots. Once you get it pretty saturated into your roots, you shake it all out, you brush your hair like you normally would, and it'll give you that second day product, good hair. Okay. Um, I do not suggest going longer than that to wash your hair. Always wash your hair because I mean, you want healthy, pretty hair. And again, start that third day. Excuse me. Uh, start that third day. Condition first. Do everything you got to do. Get in the shower and then wash. And I've actually seen Trust Me has a new thing out where um, they've come up with the brilliant idea that um, uh, you. Uh, their conditioner is two or one you do that first and then uh, you um, shampoo second well I've known this trick and most people with healthy hair have known this trick forever and now I'm telling you so that's how we are going to keep from having split ends we've split hairs and this is ginger tails with Heather Nicole and thank you for watching bye